and stuff like that. Yeah. Celebrities, today you will have the opportunity to win an evening out of camp. Oh, my goodness. We had loads of fun today playing a quiz all relating to news from home. There had to be two team captains, um, and I was nominated as one and Sabrina as the other. I'd like Jimmy. I will take... Stuart. Love is in the air. <laughs> well, 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 Everywhere. Well, 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 well. The questions that we had to answer were general questions about what's been happening on the outside at home since we've been in here. Which celebrity chef has just revealed his brand new face after a cosmetic procedure to smooth out wrinkles? Was it A, Marco Pierre White, or B, Gordon Ramsay? It would be too easy, Gordon Ramsay, because we all know about his wrinkle. Yeah, yeah. 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 okay, I'll Marco I'll Pierre White. Are you happy with that, guys? Yes. yes. Okay, the correct answer is Gordon Ramsay. Wow. Yeah, there was a weird question in there. Um, which celebrity had been pictured out drunk, and it was between Leona Lewis and Alicia? <laughs> Alicia Dixon. Do you think so? I don't... Uh, Leona doesn't have it in her. Yeah, she always seems classic. And Alicia? But then, Alicia, she loves her drink. Yes. But I know that Alicia likes to drink, and she doesn't really care. Yeah, we're going to go with Alicia. Alicia Dixon. <laughs> <laughs> she did every damn good That's girl. That's a girl. <laughs> <laughs> Which ex, Liberty X singer, oh, recently no. announced that she is pregnant? Did you not go with one of them? Yep. Which one? Jessica, Jessica Taylor. Taylor. Jessica Taylor. <laughs> Dang! <laughs> Yeah. Michelle Heaton? Yeah. I'll let's go Heaton. for, I don't know. Congratulations, Jess. Jessica. Congratulations. Congratulations. Oh. Congratulations. That is brilliant news. Congrats. I know you want a baby for ages. Well done. Good. That's awesome. Three. One of the questions in the quiz was about um, poor old Grady's dog, Buster. Whose famous dog passed away this week? Oh, not, not Buster. Yeah, not it could Buster. be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I think it is. Paul or Grady? Yeah. Is it Buster's passed away? Yeah, Buster was lovely. Oh dear, Aunt Paul, if you look, I'm so sorry, my love. I remember, oh, because yeah. before yeah. I left, it was on the paper, it wasn't very well. Yeah. That's a little bit sad. But the good news in the quiz is that Chelsea beat Arsenal. Go on, the Blues. Go on, the Blues. Who is this week's Torso of the Week in Heat magazine? Is it Mr. Zac Efron or Mr. Stuart Manning? It's going to be me. But just here? the reason, because I'm in here. Stuart Manning. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, I love that score up, man. <laughs> nice one. Happy days, Happy number days. four. No. Nice. Uh, there were some surprising things in there. One of the questions was, who dumped her boy live on TV? Katie Price? Or was it B, Peaches Geldof? Well, it's going to be Peaches Geldof, cos Katie said that Alex is coming at you. Yeah, that's true, but who knows what's happened. They could have broken up and got back together. He could have done something stupid. That's right. I say Peaches. Some, something inside me says Katie has got the nuts to do it. We thought, well, could it be Katie? Isn't she still in Australia? I'm going to go with Katie. Katie Price. <gasps> Lie! Yeah, um, man, I knew that girl would do it, man. Oh, Katie. Poor old Alex. Hop it, love. It would appear that your time is up. Well done, well done, well done. We got six right, they got four right, so we won. Well done, Sue. Yeah. <laughs> If it's KFC, <laughs> you bring me back. You bring me back a couple of bits of chicken. Sabrina, Stuart, and I, we won the quiz and we went for a bit of a fun night. I'm dying to know what they're doing. It's killing me. They're in show. a room up there. It could be a million things. I've got a funny feeling that whatever the treat is, they'll be bringing it back. Coming up, slim pickings at dinner. They're pulling our chain here a bit, aren't they? Would you like the chance to win a Nintendo Wii with your very own I'm a Celebrity video game? £10,000 cash and a shirt signed by this year's Jungle Celebrities. Watch carefully and tell us who the kids are describing and imitating. He looks a little bit like Father Christmas. He was sleeping and then a rat rolled onto him yeah. and he went, ah, 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 ah. Marvellous, darling. Who is the former Jungle Celebrity? Is it A, Darren Day? B, David Guest, or C, Christopher Biggins. Call 09049 596 596. Calls cost £1 from BT Landlines. Calls from other networks may be higher, and from mobiles will be considerably more. Or text A, B, or C as your answer to 83000. Text costs £1 plus one standard network rate message. Sky and Virgin Media viewers, press red. Or enter online for free at ITV.com. Entrance must be 18 or over, and lines close at 10 a.m. on Monday, the 7th of December. Entries made after the closing time will not be counted, 
but may still be charged. Welcome back to I'm a Celebrity, get me out of here. The phone lines have now closed. Please do not call. Your vote won't count, but you may still be charged. Before the break, we saw Sabrina's team triumph in the quiz. Their prize was a karaoke night. A treat for them, but a punishment for you at home. Satellite and digital viewers can enhance their enjoyment of this feature by pressing their mute buttons now. Ah! Was it a karaoke? Is that like a... Oh, no! <laughs> oh, look, oh, no! <laughs> It's karaoke! <laughs> <laughs> when we arrived at the top of the hill, we saw a glitter ball up there. Two mics and a TV screen. Karaoke! I'm rubbish at karaoke. OK, wait, 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 wait. What have we got? What have we got? Considering that we were in the middle of the jungle is an unbelievable experience. Salute mm. to the winning team. Salute. Mm. Salute. Salute. Yeah. OK. Right. Sorry, I'm getting distracted by the peanuts. We had some pretzels and some nuts and a couple of bits. The nuts were probably some of the nicest things I've tasted in a while. Oh, my God, they got scandalous. Right, is it? The first song we sang, it was uh, a Scandalous from Mystique, because, of course, it was one of Sabrina's song when she was in Mystique, and we did really bad. I'm... You know you, you want to sing, sing with us? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Are you sure? <laughs> That's what you want to try on us? <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Bars, looks to kill. Straight talk, sex appeal. Sabrina obviously has the best voice I've ever heard. Now Love watching you your moves and you hypnotize me. me. You got me trembling <laughs> like a little baby girl. <laughs> I personally wasn't very good on the singing, but I didn't care. I just wanted to enjoy myself and uh, just have fun. Do you know a song to be sex bomb? Because <laughs> he's been on heat. Seward and I, we decided to sing for Sabrina. Sex bomb, sex bomb, sex bomb. you're my sex bomb. <laughs> and you can give me to me when you need to tell me long. Sex bomb, <laughs> what sex are you bomb. Doing? I don't know. You're my sex bomb. <laughs> how, how do you dance sex bomb? So my movement was only like this, because that's, you know, how do you dance sex bomb? That is the only dance move that I know. And baby, baby you can turn me on. They were. Funny, I was nearly, I nearly peed my pants. And hey, baby, you, you can, can turn me on. <sighs> Sorry, Sabrina. That was excellent. Give the the uh, Simon Cowell comments. Stuart, you're very pleasing on the eye. <laughs> but when it comes to music, mm -hmm. I think you should stick to pictures. There, there was a hidden compliment there. Gino, Ooh. you had the moves, you had the charisma. You 